guys. So one thing we just had to say about 120 bucks is our local feed store is offering up a deal. They're doing a customer appreciation day and their grain's two dollars off a bag. So I went and I picked up a pallet, which is 40 bags of pig feed. And I picked up seven bags of meat bird crumbles and seven bags of egg layer pellets for now. I can go back tomorrow and get some more, but I think at this point this is enough. I got about 54 bags. I got a load now. So now the fun pop begins. I gotta get this in there. Here we go. So we don't have a barn or anything. And I don't, we're not leaving it outside because we don't want the mice or anything to get into it. So we're bringing it in the basement and we're going to store it in the basement and keep it nice and dry. Unloading my grain, I was just thinking about when I checked out at the grain store today. She rang me up and she said 124 bucks. And I went, Wow, that's cheap. She forgot something. I said to her, I said, You sure? She goes, Yep. I said, I don't think you're right. I think you better recheck it. I don't think you charged me for all the pig feed. She goes, No, 124 bucks. I said, I'll take it. But I don't think you're right. You might want to recheck. So she did. And she went, Yeah. You're right, it's 442. So, she goes, boy, it's been a long day, thank you. I just try to treat people the way I want to be treated. It would take that little store quite a bit of time and profit to make up that little bit of lost money that they would have lost. So, just think about that next time. If something like that happens to you, if you were in the other person's shoe, how would you feel or what would you want to happen to you? That's just my little takeaway on it today. I try to treat people the way I want to be treated. I had my own mechanical garage before, so I know how hard it is and how much you have to work to make a buck. I know even working for somebody, well, I'm working as a mechanic right now for somebody. It's hard and it takes a lot of money to make a buck. 300 bucks in my pocket would have been nice, but I was still getting this deal the way it was with two bucks off. I don't need to be stealing from them, so. If I would have taken the grain at the 124 bucks, I would have just stolen about probably 30 bags of pig food from him. 
just something I was thinking about. I thought I'd share it with you guys.